Hey, how's it going guys? It's Crazy and Monkey here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to be able to get Quiet, Bag of Punch like by the round way. 6. Uh, so pretty much what you're going to want to do is you're trying to consume as much points as possible and try to waste as much points as possible as well. What I would recommend is try to shoot the zombies about 2 to 3 times in the first round and then shank them with the shovel. And that should give you a total of 160 points or 150 points. And you keep doing this until probably round 3. Just try to consume as much points as you can. And then also I'm going to show you the round uh, for the doors for the easiest and fastest way. So first up you got to open up this door. And all you have to do is you have to turn on the power generators. Um, you have to turn the valves. There's three valves for the power generator. This is the first one. Sometimes zombies appear up in this little window here. So make sure you got to watch your back for any jump scares or if Dude, you have your back turn do? so we got one down now we gotta go to this side to turn on the second so you hold that and then as i said before the zombie pops up in these windows so just make sure to keep holding until you actually go all the way and the light turns green and then the third one is through this door so just make sure to go all the way down and then you're gonna see the third and final one for the power generator and then once again, another zombie pops up here, so make sure to kill them before they kill you. Okay, so once you go out three, then you gotta go to the middle, and then now you have to activate the power switch. Oh, bloody hell! So just go, it's actually a trap. Um, as soon as you activate it, there are gonna be zombies. After you got this step done, what you have to do next is you have to turn on the power uh, you gotta go down here and then you gotta activate the power generator inside the tunnel So as you can see here, I'm activating this one and now you have to open the vault or the bunker. Once you got in there, then pretty much what you have to do next the main thing to get the uh, pack a punch is you have to go through three sewers and you have to press a button Looks in order to unlock the cage the which holds two. the pack a punch So as you can see, there's one sewer right here and then what we're gonna do the fastest way you gotta open up this door first you have to activate a button um that actually enables the cage to be unlocked so you gotta go down here and this little cage here is a pack of punch what the hell? So you gotta we go back the here earthquake. and then in this power switch just make sure you activate it um you also want to be careful because sometimes when you activate one of the four power switches the room does turn red and uh that was the once I activate this, the whole room will turn red, I'll give it a red glow, and then zombies will come out of nowhere, so make sure you're prepared for that as well. So, we're going to the second one. The second one here is in the laboratory, so make sure you go down here, and then as soon as you go through this, there's going to be the third, the second sewer to your left. So, there it is. So make sure you're able to kill out any zombies before you go in. You bloody fucker! Okay. And then once again, once you go in the sewer, you gotta activate the power switch to your right. Activate that and you have to go. The last one will be where the power level power levels are. Um, it's the third and the final one. So once you go through here, pretty much in this area, then you'll be ready to go. So you go down here, activate the third and the final power switch, and then you are ready to use the pack. guys i hope this was really helpful for you guys uh make sure to leave me a like and subscribe and i will upload a lot more content for world war ii thanks peace